are you? I am good. Excellent. Uh, I'm gonna get a card. Okay. I'll put twenty-five dollars on that with my Visa, and I'll also get a large double double, please. Oh, twenty-five thousand dollars! Woo! Nice. Nice. As long as you only put twenty-five on my Visa, we're good. <laughs> Hold on, Ernie. I get this figured out eventually. Two five. How many coffees is that? And do you have a reward card? Uh, not yet. Someday. Ron? You should be just gonna activate it. Sure. Activated. There you go. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, got my coffee. We're headed over to uh, Henry's because it is family day, family and friends day, where the prices are the best prices in the whole year. Better than Boxing Day, better than Black Friday. So, cheers. Mm. Brian, who's the manager there, sent me a text and invited me down. But it's common knowledge now too. So, but I was kind of warned ahead of time, which is good. So, I've got a rewards card. I'm not sure what that really entails. I'll have to read up on it. I've been asked that in the past, and I kept thinking they meant the regular card. But we'll check that out. We'll sip some more coffee, and then uh, we're right now we're in uh, Newmarket, and uh, Henry says just over there. Let's go get some new gear. Made it over to Henry's. Let's go. Oh, left the lights on. Let's go <clears throat> put a few items on my visa. Hello. Hello. How's it going, man? All right. How you doing? I'm excellent. Very nice to see you. Very nice to see you. Very nice to see you again. Would you like some treats? Treats. Treats for you. Hey. Treats for you. I just bought a coffee. Oh man. <laughs> All right, guys. This is Joseph. Joseph is showing me the ropes of all the different cameras and he is really pushing on the R. Not pushing, he's, he's, he knows what I need and so he's telling me this is the, probably the best camera for me. And it's also got the flip out screen which, as opposed to a lot of the other cameras or the flip up screen which blocks. If you have a flip up screen here then you can't put a microphone on there so having it flip out to the side which is great, the articulating arm. This is about the size of the camera that I have right now. This is as close to the 70D as they sell. The 70, 70D has been discontinued. Um, and here's the like size difference. So it's a lot skinnier this way, maybe a little bit smaller width-wise, not by much. But it's such a much smaller camera. I know this is heavier because of the lens, but that is nice. What? The lens, the kit lens that comes with it, 24 to 105, is actually, I was told last night, sharper than the actual 24 to 105 pound. Like the one that you but it get drives the price up of this, if that's a kit, right? It comes as a kit, right. but it's, it's the proprietary lens for the camera. So right. it's not like you're needing the adapter to convert it to your Canon lenses you may have. Right. right. So as a kit, it's a little smaller, it's fast, it's made to match with the mirrorless system. So. But if I bought that kit, and then use your extra lenses that you have with the adapter for the detail and the creative. But the kit, does it come with the adapter plus? Yeah, it comes with the adapter. Even with the lens. With an extra battery. Okay. There you go. So it comes body, lens, adapter, adapter yeah. and that's probably what, would you say 20? 16.99. No, no, with the, with the, the lens. 24 to 105, the kit. Check that for you. Yeah, I want to make sure the kit has by you recommending that kit? Well, I'm just thinking, if you're gonna start off with a new camera, going for the lens that it's supposed to work with would just make that more efficient. Okay. You know what I mean? That yeah. it's made to work with the focusing system and uh, so on. So. With the lens, with the okay. He's driving up the price. He's driving up the price. <laughs> I think I just bought a new camera. Don't tell Carol. Thanks, Brian. My pleasure, Brian. Thank you so much. Brian's the man. See ya. Thanks, man. All the best, man. Enjoy. I will. All right, now it's time to go hang out with Steve. We we're supposed to go for a bike ride, pack up all my stuff. It's in the car, but it's like, I don't know, six degrees. And, uh, oh, I just wanted to show you all the stuff they had here. Welcome to Henry's. I didn't really show it, but they got bounty. I'm going to grab one bounty. Yes, a bounty. 
So we, it's like six degrees and it's raining. So we don't do six degrees and raining in the first bike ride. It's a bounty. I'm not sure if you've ever had one of these. It's basically coconut covered in chocolate. They make these in um, a new market. There's a Mars plant. Mmm, mm, I used to hate coconut, coconut chocolate, I guess. I've grown to like it. It's lovely. All right, let's go see Steve. Bumped into Steven. How's it going? Not too bad. Everything's good? Yeah, it's all good. Let's say you got a Stella. I did. Excellent. Nice I, frosty glass. Look at this. It looks super frosty. That's a nice one that you have the frosty glass. Yeah. It's just an added touch. Mine's frosty too, and it's stuck to my cardboard at the moment. I got a Canadian, and she put it in a Canadian glass, which is always good. We just ordered like a little bucket of fries just to share, and we're just going to catch up on old times, and, and uh, then we'll head back to our, our own dwellings. Three lives, yes. <laughs> Well, our fries came. Those are nice big, uh, almost steak cut fries with a bit of a, a wedge to them. All right, so I just realized that this, it comes with a, I guess a dill dip? It's a dill dip. Yeah, and it's good. It's actually... You like uh, dill? I don't mind dill. I just don't like a, a pickle. It's totally different. Again, pickles, I don't think the flavor of a pickle bothers me. It's a texture of slimy, I don't know, something bizarre. Will you eat a cucumber, though? No. That makes me sick. Wow. Okay. Okay, I was going to call you a hypocrite, but... <laughs> right, yeah. People do, actually. They try to trick me. Uh -huh. That's good. Steve, it's nice seeing you again. You too, you too. We're going to be doing a, a birthday lunch on Tuesday. Somebody's turning 62. 67. 67. Yes. I'm, I'm doing good for a 67-year-old, I think. Mm -hmm. So you'll see Steve again on Tuesday. Just realized I need to gas up. Gas here is a dollar twenty-seven six per liter. So, just thought I'd give you guys a heads up on how much gas costs in this part of Ontario. Not too bad we didn't get to do our bike ride today. Uh, I was a little disappointed in that. Uh, I was under the impression that it was supposed to be a really good day today and tomorrow, but apparently some type of a front moved in. It's like kind of like a spitting kind of rain and there's a haze in the distance a little bit of fog but it's been like that all day either that or just straight on raining and uh but what can you do so tomorrow i'm going to help carl uh teach one of his new camera guys some of the techniques that we want him to use when shooting stuff for us and uh yeah that's what i'm gonna be doing tomorrow hopefully it's a much better day than today Almost 50 bucks to fill this car. Jeez. It wasn't even empty. I guess it was close, but it wasn't empty. So yeah, I think I can put 42 liters in this tank. The size of that receipt. Holy schmoly. All right, let's go home and play with our camera. All right, guys, let's get to this unboxing done. I think I forgot, hang on, my knife. I'm going to try not to damage any of the packaging because I have this really bad feeling that this camera might, might not be the exact camera. I've done, I have done a lot of research on this thing, but one of the things that's kind of driving me nuts is the fact that these batteries only last about 30 minutes and the camera that I'm using now, which is one of my white cameras, uh, it lasts, hang on. This is the camera that I'm using right now to shoot this. And this is what I've been using for the past two years uh, for the vlog channel. That's just the waterproof case. I'll continue using these. This is the Sony FDR X3000 action cam with 4K capabilities. One of the things I would like to do is shoot as much this week with this camera uh, for vlogging and stuff. We got our books. We've got our charger for the battery. Again, I'm going to try as best as possible to not damage anything. 
because if I have to return this, it's going to be in mint condition. This is a little, what is that? Oh, it's like a lens bag. We've got our battery. Take that out. Let's see the camera. This is the lens. I was only going to buy the body, the adapter, and then start using my own lens. But it turns out that lens is made for that camera. This lens is made for this camera. And uh, it's a um, different kind of sensor. So it's meant for cropped cameras. Or, yeah. So here we go. Here is our Canon. Check that out. The Canon R. EOS R. And again, the flip out screen. Oh, nice. So uh, we'll charge the battery. Uh, what I also got was a four, this can shoot 4K. Uh, it's a 64 gig card. Uh, the card that I've been using for the big uh, 7DD, uh, the little switch on it is really delicate. So you, sometimes you put it into the camera, you shut it to go take a picture, it says it's on lock. So you gotta open it up, take the thing, push it thing, and slide it in as carefully as possible. Same when I take it out and put it into my card reader, it, it's almost like it shuts off. So uh, I will hang on to that a little bit longer, not open it, but I'll pop, I guess I'll open it because that's fine. I'm not gonna open up the extra battery at the moment. Uh, there's our lens. Let's put this at least together. It's a very, very heavy lens. Feel it. You can't feel it. All right, this probably just slides off. One of the one of the issues people were saying on some of the reviews is that there's no protection to the sensor. So you gotta find the red dot, add that, line it up. Let me add it. There we go. Turn, lock. I want it to be on auto. Stabilizer on. And then it's got a in a stabilizer in here and in here. That's one of the only problems with this setup at the moment. You know, I'm going from this to this. I will still continue to use this. That has a lot of great applications. Uh, but again, look at the size difference. This will this will shoot way better footage. And I can't wait to show you guys. Uh, one of the things you should buy when you buy a lens like this, very expensive lens, uh, you need to protect that as much as possible. So I bought this. I will put that on there immediately. And there's an adapter that I can put that on this camera, put the 50 mil on there. I might have to buy like a, I don't know, a 16 mil or whatever. One of my favorite things about this is it's 24105 lens. So I'll be able to zoom in on things. That's another thing, it's got a lock for the zoom. There we go. So I'll be able to zoom in. Uh, zoom in on things like um, I remember last year when we were in Hawaii I, I found a monk seal but they had roped off where he was because they didn't want people going up to it uh, for the safety of the animal plus the safety of you and somebody said you know you're a filmmaker why don't you zoom in well I use these cameras especially when I go for a big walk I don't want to be lugging around something like this so I couldn't zoom in because I have an action cam and if you zoom in through the software it just looks like crap so uh, I prefer not to use that so now I've got a little bit of a zoom capability I checked it out in the store when I was purchasing it I uh, played with it for quite a while but uh, that is the unboxing I think I showed you everything I don't think I need to show you guys any more stuff uh, you can put these together learned that from uh, Peter McKinnon anyway I just wanted to make sure I got the unboxing done for this vlog so you guys can see what I purchased at the store i'm looking forward to this footage a lot i'm hoping you guys are looking forward to it as well you will definitely see a huge difference in the quality of the videos i make from here going forward unless i return it to get a different camera because i didn't like the fact that the batteries die every 30 minutes ciao